Hey everyone, Don with Brazia Toneworks and thanks for watching. Today's video is all about the HSS Auto Split mod. This is a mod that you can do with any HSS or HSH type guitar with a five way standard selector switch. It doesn't require any extra drilling or push pull switches. It's a very simple mod that you can do, just a couple wire changes. Now, with a normal five way switch, position number two, you would have a full humbucker and your middle coil pickup. Now, a lot of times that humbucker is overpowering and guys want to actually split that right away. So rather than, again, doing a push-pull or some sort of a toggle switch, this is going to auto-split the humbucker. So in position two, you're going to have a split humbucker along with the middle coil. So it's giving you kind of like that strat, second position, quack kind of sound if you're looking for that. Okay, let's get started. As always, I go over some of my identifiers so you understand where I'm going. Left side of your switch is going to be A1, 2, 3, and 4. The right side is going to be B, 1, 2, 3, and 4. Okay, here is how a standard five-way switch is typically wired. You have your bridge coming into A1, middle A2, neck A3. You've got a jumper from A4 up to B1, which goes to your volume. And then you've got some combination for your tone pots, depending, again, exactly on which strat and any other mods you might have done. Okay, to do this mod, there's a few minor changes we have to do. Starting out, we're going to keep our bridge, middle, and neck hot going to the same lug. So bridge to A1, middle to A2, neck to A3. Now you're going to notice A4 is going to go directly to our volume pot or our output. We're not going to have a jumper back over to B1 like we did on the standard switch. So A4 is directly to your output. Now you'll notice up on the top, I've got the green and the kind of the bare wires. Now I'm using the Seymour Duncan wire code colors here. So just keep that in mind. You might have to look at your own color code for your humbuckers. But in this particular case, the green and the bare represent the ground for the humbucker. So we're going to take that to our ground point. The coil split, which is the red and the white, is going to go to lug B2 on this switch. You can see that here with the red and white wire. Now you'll notice that B3 is going to ground as well, and that's what's actually going to help us split that coil. So when we hit position number two, lug B3 is activated, which is going to ground the coil splits. Lugs B1 and B4 are completely empty, if you'll notice. There's nothing going to those. Now we need to talk a little bit about your tone controls. Now the way this mod works, you can't have more than two pickups having tone control. So you can't combine pickup. So you can't have a middle and a neck joined with one tone control and a bridge with another. You only get two pickups that have tone controls. And what I did here is I took the middle pickup from lug A2 and I run that to my first tone pot. And I go for my neck pickup from A3 to my tone pot as well. So you can see my tone controls are connected to the A side of the switch. Middle to A2, neck to A3. Now, some people will obviously want to have their bridge with a tone control. So here's what it would look like modified. I could take my A1, which is my bridge pickup, and I can go to tone 2. And I can take my neck, which is A3, and I can go to tone 1. You can mix and match those if you want. You can move to your middle pickup to have a tone control and not your neck and vice versa. So you do have a few flexibilities with regard to the tone controls, but remember, you can only have two pickups having tone controls. You cannot share tone with pickups. So how does this look? Basically, what you're going to have in position one, as expected, we're going to have our full humbucker. In position two, we're going to have the inside coil of that humbucker as a split along with the middle. Well, there you go. A very simple, easy to do mod, just a couple of wire changes, and you're able to split that humbucker in position two, giving yourself more of a strat type, you know, quack position sound in that uh, particular switch position rather than maybe having that humbucker again overpowering that middle coil. Thanks for watching. I really appreciate it. If you have any questions or comments, please email me at brasiatoneworks at gmail.com. And remember, tone. It's not just a knob, it's sound advice.